He is courtside now with Nick Lester. Carl, well done. What pleased you the most today? Uh, just similar to um, the first match, feeling good, uh, just really managing the game. It's one of them where I knew I had a bit more fight power than Radu uh, in general, but he's playing uh, probably his best tennis of his life right now. So it's basically just feeling confident, but knowing you're going to have to really tough out the match when it comes to it. Um, I was just happy I played. It's slightly different here in the stadium, different sort of paces, bounces, con um, surroundings. But again, to come off with a 3-3 three three win, it's uh, you know pleasing. When was the last time you felt this good, Carl, on a tennis court? You've obviously put together a nice run of results. Yeah. Going back to Antwerp, maybe? Yeah, maybe. I mean, um, last year I was feeling good, well, not most of it, but when I got a run of matches, then I really came into form. It was kind of up and down with my form. Um, maybe coming off a bit of illnesses or an injury, but once I got going, I was pleased. Obviously in Australia, but I built up momentum on the clay through the grass, and then obviously at the end of the year through Asia and getting my first tour win. But now that I'm able to, um, after Australia, get some matches in uh, five last week and then two now, I really feel my game um, where I need to improve, where my strengths are. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy. It's just one of them like you don't get too happy you know you just got to keep getting better, better because these guys are very good players you play a Swiss next we know that yeah uh, <laughs> obviously you've played uh, Stan a few times mm. just share some memories of Roger at Lever Cup last year I'm guessing stands out I guess you got to know him a little better during the Lever Cup yeah for sure um, to be honest, he is how you see him very, very relaxed uh, very chilled um, it's great to sort of engage him off the court just chat about different things not just tennis and saying hello in the change rooms and stuff um, but yeah, pure, pure class, talent, um, great to be around. He was a really good teammate as well, very supportive of everyone. So I enjoyed it, but you know, we'll see when you play him on the court, he's your enemy, so you want to go and beat him, so you've got to put that out of your head. Keep it going, Carl. Well done. Thank you.